This is Medio Mundo. Hello, Jamaica. I am Medio Mundo Chief Meteorologist Rusty McCraney, and thank you for tuning in to the latest video. It's your forecast, Jamaica. We've got you covered right here in Media Mundo. Thank you for liking the uh, video. Thank you for subscribing as well. Here's what's happening on this Thursday. We are once again going to see a high chance for showers across the island as we get into the afternoon hours. What's very interesting is I'm still watching some moisture coming in. Take a look at these features. Almost kind of looks like a street of some tropical waves coming in. Now, they're very weak in nature, but it's very interesting how they're lining up. This is an interesting feature though just south of the Dominican Republic we'll be watching that move off towards the west I don't expect there to be any tropical development out of this but it is once again going to throw some moisture back into our area keeping our rain chances fairly high over the next several days so just get ready for that but again it's all not bad news though it's been so hot lately we could use some of these showers to cool things off now it may not cool things off very much though because these showers will be in the afternoon hours but take a look at the rain chance on our model here over the next two days. So this is gonna be for the rest of Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. I'm gonna pause this in a couple of different spots here. We'll go back and take a look at what's gonna be happening for the afternoon hours of this Thursday. So I expect some showers towards Kingston and Mandeville on over towards Negril. Maybe the northern side of the island is slightly drier, but if you live along the southern coastline, we can see some heftier showers developing. Certainly an isolated thunderstorm is possible as well. And again, that's for the remainder of the afternoon hours. As we get into the evening, as it typically does, it begins to dry out. But this model even tries to bring in a couple of light showers, at least across the area into Friday morning. And then in Friday afternoon, at least more scattered showers. Maybe not as prominent or as heavy as what we saw for today, but there's still that chance. And then more tropical moisture comes in on Saturday. Take a look at that again, developing uh, mainly in the afternoon hours. So this is four o'clock on Saturday, right across the island again from the Kingston area to the north and to the west, across the interior locations, Negril on the northern side, Montego Bay, certainly a chance for some scattered showers there. And you can see that rain chance sticks around for Saturday afternoon. So just overall, again, pretty good chance for some showers across the area. I'm going to zoom out just a little bit. We'll put that back into motion for you here. And again, you can see that there's just an abundant amount of rain across the Northwest Caribbean in the next couple of days. So even the Cayman Islands will see some good scattered showers and we'll see that moisture continuing to move in from the east to give us a decent chance for some rain. So for the marine interest, this is the marine forecast for coastal waters off of the Kingston area. For the remainder of Thursday, east winds at 10 to 15 knots. For Friday, east winds at 10 to 20 knots. And by the way, if you live in Kingston, I'd love to hear uh, what's happening in the area. Just love to say, hey, Rusty, it actually did rain today or no, we stay dry. Or if you live in other parts of the island, again, please just let me know in the comments below. I always love to hear from the folks who actually live in these areas that we're forecasting for. Got 92 for the daytime high in Kingston. But here's the problem. The feels like temperature is up to 105. Please take it very easy in the afternoon hours. Find the shade and drink plenty of water when you can. Again, we'll get a 60% chance of storms moving in late in the afternoon hours. On the five-day forecast for Kingston, going to stay with that 60% chance through Saturday. So a fairly good opportunity for showers and storms across the island, at least through the early part of the weekend. That moisture tailing off just a little bit Sunday and Monday. But again, not much lower lower chance for rain. We're going to stay with a 50% chance on Sunday and Monday. Again, these are mainly afternoon storms dying out as we get into the evening and daytime highs remaining in the lower 90s, but feels like temperatures or what it really feels like to your body when you step outside in the afternoon. It's going to stay above 100 degrees at least over the next five days. Thanks for tuning in, Jamaica. We appreciate you. Again, thanks for liking the channel and thanks for subscribing as well. And you want that latest forecast for Jamaica. We'll see you next time on Media Mundo.